Hey everybody, it's Amber from Seasonal Living and I just wanted to share with you my plans for January. Uh, last year, some of you might have seen my video that I made right around the new year and I mentioned that I usually take January as a month of grace for myself. I sort of um, take it to just quiet everything down, um, close everything up from the holidays. Um, it, the holidays are just so noisy, at least for me. Um, there's so much to do. There's so much I want to do. Um, and I usually just take January to sort of reflect on what the last year looked like and what the holidays looked like. And um, usually take that time to look forward to the new year and to see what do I want my next year to look like. Um, as I mentioned, I'm all about living seasonally. And so this for me means what's the next season of life look? for me personally for the next year. Um, I know a lot of people try to do their New Year's resolutions like January 1st right out of the gate and that's great. If you already have your plan and are ready to go, I will 100% pray for you and support you. Um, but for me, I live a little slower, I guess. Like I just don't, I can't process things that quickly. Um, and I really want to desperately be present for the holidays. Um, for Christmas especially and I have to be right here right now for the holidays and then after that I will take a little bit of time just for me um, to reflect to look forward like I mentioned and to really kind of ground myself into this is a new year um, what do I want what do I want my priorities to be um, so that's what I'm gonna be doing for January I'm actually going to do a social media fast and what that's gonna look like for me is I'm not going to be looking at uh, Pinterest pray for me there because that's gonna be a challenge <laughs> um, there is gonna be no YouTube no Facebook Facebook I've pretty much pulled back you know most 100% like it's just not um, doesn't serve me much anymore other than to keep up with family that's why I keep it no Instagram I'm not a huge Instagram person, but I do enjoy it. I think it's a nice platform and I, I love seeing the beautiful pictures that other people um, share and I really find it a good source of inspiration. Um, but I feel like, at least for now, um, I need a break. A break from all the um, overload stimulation coming from the outside. Um, I really need to go inward to see what are my priorities, what are the things that are most important to me, not necessarily what's important to someone else, um, because that's their life to live, you know? I find inspiration from a lot of different people on social media, on YouTube, on Instagram, on all these great platforms, uh, but sometimes I tend to want to do all of the, th all the things that everybody else wants to do, and that's not healthy for me, and it's probably not healthy for anybody else, so... Um, I sort of got inspired by Mandy from Sweetly Home. Love her. Hi, Mandy. Um, I She had mentioned on one of her Instagram posts over Christmas that she was just sort of taking a break, taking a break from all the information coming in and just focusing on her own home and her own family. And I feel very inspired by that. And I challenge you as well. If you feel like this is a good time for you to do a social media fast, I 100% would support you and pray for you, all that good stuff. So that's kind of where I'm going to be. I probably won't be posting anything over January just to take some quiet time. And I'll be back to share um, my probably like sort of like a schedule for the next year, um, but sort of what I have for my channel and what I'm thinking of um, focusing on for the next coming year. So I hope you'll join me if you feel so inclined. Um, if not, have a wonderful, happy new year, and I will see you in the next season.